Welcome to part 2 of the top poodle crossbreeds that exist, and probably the most famous dog breed that gets crossbred with dozens of other dog breeds. In this video, we talk about 18 poodle mixed breeds that you will definitely love. Let us know in the comments which one you prefer, and don't forget to watch part 1 after this video. And if you're looking for a new puppy for your family, Puppy Spot is the best place. Click on the links in the description to find out more about Puppy Spot. Number 1. Newfie Doodle The Newfie Doodle is a mix between a Newfoundland and a Poodle. A mix between a Newfoundland and a Poodle, the Newfie Poo is a big, big dog with a heart to match. There's no doubting this dog's ability to love, and the affectionate side of both the Newfoundland and the Poodle shines through with this doodle. Considered a large or even giant mix depending on the size of the adult dog, the Newfie Poo requires a lot of space, a lot of playtime and a lot of attention. If you have time, this mix is great for families and children with its kind disposition and gentle nature. Just be prepared to go through a lot of food and treats to keep it satisfied. Number 2. Aussie Doodle the Aussie Doodle is a mix between an Australian Shepherd and Poodle. An Aussie Doodle is a very happy and playful mix of an Australian Shepherd and a Poodle. These dogs are great companion dogs who have even been used as service animals. They have a teddy bear look and usually grey, black and white. These dogs come in two different sizes depending on what size Poodle is the parent. The Aussie Doodles love hugs and cuddles. They will try to get in your lap no matter how big they are. These dogs will be great for people who are also very social. Number 3. Woodle The Woodle is a mix between a soft-coated Wheaton Terrier and Poodle. A Woodle is possibly one of the least common doodle mixes. The Wheaton Terrier is one of the larger breeds of Terrier and while energetic, do not have the barking or overwhelming prey drive of some smaller Terriers. While any Terrier is naturally more inclined to sniff and smell about, these mixes have many different personalities depending on the individual dog. Wheaton Terriers are great family dogs that are dependable, friendly and easy to train. Poodles also train well and are overall intelligent, so it's likely the Woodle is rewarding to teach. Number 4. Irish Doodle The Irish Doodle is a mix between an Irish Setter and a Poodle. This strikingly red pup is one of the most popular Irish Setter crossbreeds. Typically, the Irish Doodle will inherit a red coat from their Irish Setter parents, while taking on the texture and coat consistency from their Poodle parents. Irish Doodles are medium-sized dogs that typically will not get larger than 60 pounds, regardless of their gender. They get along extremely well with children and in multi-pet households. They are very active and will need a decent-sized yard to run around on. While they can adapt to apartment living, they will usually do better with a house and at least a medium-sized yard. Number 5. Springer Doodle the Springer Doodle is a mix between an English Springer Spaniel and a Poodle. The Springer Doodle is a very popular designer dog breed that is seen today. Other names for this breed include Sprudel, Springer Doodle Retriever, Springer Poo and Springer Poo Retriever. These are medium-sized dogs that are very smart and active. This makes them a wonderful family pet. These dogs are very playful and they love spending time with kids and other members of the family. They're also great with other dogs and love to play outdoors with other four-legged friends. A Springer Doodle would be a great addition to a multi-dog household. Very common colors seen in Springer Doodles are black, brown, white, cream or a combination of these. Number 6. Shipu The Shipu is a mix between a Shih Tzu and a Poodle. The Shipu will inherit characteristics from both parent breeds. For a good understanding of them, it's a great idea to learn all about their Shih Tzu and Poodle parents. Shih Tzus can be stubborn, but what they lack in trainability, they make up for in personality, tenfold. They are incredibly friendly, attentive and cute, while Poodles are intelligent, trainable and active. Shipu personalities can vary, but typically will fall in the middle of parental traits. Most Shipus are described as friendly and playful. They're the size of your average lap dog and their moderate energy level means they'd probably enjoy napping in your lap for hours. Number 7. Westy Poo 
The Westie Poo is a mix between a West Highland White Terrier and Poodle. A fluffy, cute pooch with a fantastic personality, the Westie Poo is among the more popular designer dog breeds for good reason. This sturdy little hybrid is a happy, family-oriented dog that loves to be around others and gets along famously with household pets and older kids. He's a terrific companion dog and his compact stature and minimal shedding make him a great fit for apartment dwellers. In other words, this is a dog that will fit into almost any home with ease. Why is this dog such a crowd pleaser? It's all thanks to this beloved doggo's unique lineage. Number 8. Basset Doodle The Basset Doodle is a mix between a Basset Hound and a Poodle. These breeds have very similar personalities and temperaments, but they look very different. A Basset Doodle can get their looks from either parent. They can look like a Poodle and have curly hair or have short hair like the Basset Hound parent. Many times this breed has very short legs like a Basset Hound. A Basset Doodle is usually very calm and friendly. They are very social dogs and love to be the center of attention. They tend to get along with almost everyone and all pets. This makes them a great pet for a multi-pet house. Number 9. Corgi Poo The Corgi Poo is a mix between a Corgi and Poodle. A wonderful family pet, the Corgi Poo gets on well with people of all ages and is a social little chap. They are mischief makers that enjoy playing with the children and typically show a lot of affection. They remain loyal to their family, though can become over-attached. Over-reliance on humans may result in separation anxiety in later life, so should be discouraged. The Corgi Poo would not make a good watchdog or guard dog as they are not hostile or territorial at all. They will often greet unexpected guests warmly and welcome strangers with open paws. Number 10. Boar Doodle the Boar Doodle is a mix between a Border Collie and Poodle. The Boar Doodle is a happy, friendly dog who rarely meets a stranger. Boar Doodles are known to be friendly, highly sociable and rarely, if ever, aggressive. They are extremely loyal to their families and are great with children as well as senior adults. They are highly protective of their family members. They are also highly intelligent and they do well with other pets whether canine or feline. It's important that children are gentle with them, however. Proper socialization is key for both children and the Boar Doodle. The Boar Doodle is highly trainable as well. Number 11. Papipoo The Papipoo is a mix between a Papillon and Poodle. Papipoos are fabulous family dogs given their loving, loyal, playful personalities. They will want to be with you as much as possible and don't do well when left alone for very long periods of time. They can be a bit sensitive, so take care with your tone when speaking to them because they will take it to heart. And physical punishment is never a good idea with any dog. Their loyalty will manifest itself in becoming your shadow around the house, never leaving your side, as well as in notifying you if there are any strangers nearby or if something is amiss. Number 12. Peekapoo The Peekapoo is a mix between a pecking geese and poodle. These fabulous little dogs can have an outgoing and active personality. While they may be perfectly content to cuddle up on your lap one minute, they would love to go on a walk with you in an instant. Since they are a hybrid, they may exhibit more pecking geese traits than poodle traits or vice versa. However, both the poodle and the pecking geese are friendly and outgoing dogs. The difference between one peckapoo and another may not be as noticeable as with some other hybrids. Number 13. Australian Labradoodle The Australian Labradoodle is a mix between an Australian Shepherd and Poodle. The Australian Labradoodle can be described as loyal, non-aggressive, happy, social, curious and clever. This breed is known for being easy to train, so your dog will pick up tricks and rules in a short amount of time. You can also expect that your pet will be amusing and active. When properly socialized and trained, these pooches are friendly, and they get along well with children and other pets, including other canines. They aren't afraid to show affection, and they will form a tight bond with your family. They even make great therapy dogs and guide dogs. Number 14. Jackapoo the Jackapoo is a mix between a Jack Russell Terrier and Poodle. Lovable, hyperactive, sweet yet gentle, this breed makes the perfect all-round pet for almost any owner. They are easily adaptable and are great for those in rural and city areas. 
Jakapu will never be too far from their owner and strongly dislikes being left alone for long periods of time. If this happens consistently, they could develop separation anxiety. The terrier in this breed is what gives them that tough edge. If a Jakapu feels they are the ruler of the roost, their behavior could become disorderly. You must show them you are in charge. Number 15. Lhasa Poo The Lhasa Poo is a mix between a Lhasa Apso and Poodle. The Lhasa Poo's temperament depends on several things, including the temperaments of his parents, especially the mother, who is more likely to influence a puppy's behavior. He might be more standoffish if the Lhasa side of his family dominates, or more playful if the Poodle side prevails. Both Lhasas and Poodles can have a proud and dignified demeanor, but Poodles are more likely to enjoy showing off their tricks and good looks. A Lhasa Poo can be smart. He also might sometimes be a little stubborn and independent. But if you train him with positive reinforcement techniques, he's likely to learn quickly. Number 16. Have a Poo the Havapoo is a mix between a Havanese and Poodle. The Havapoo is a friendly, non-aggressive dog who will stick by you like glue. When he isn't playing with his favorite chew toy or gingerly licking your three-year-old's grubby little fingers, they're always on the lookout. While they're not known to be yappy, the Havapoo will gladly alert you when a stranger arrives at your door with a bark or two. But once they see you welcoming your guest, they're quick to greet this newcomer with their most charming face and a loving lick on the cheek. Havapoos will never be effective guard dogs. They're simply too sweet and affectionate to fall into that role. Number 17. Dalma Doodle the Dalmadoodle is a mix between a Dalmatian and a Poodle. You can expect that your Dalmadoodle will enjoy being around people and will love everyone. Although Dalmadoodles can be protective and might be inclined to bark at strangers, they will become comfortable around new people once they get to know them. These charming and friendly dogs could be easygoing and calm, but they could also be playful, brave and goofy. They do require quite a bit of attention, so make sure you have the time to dedicate to your pet. In return, your Dalma Doodle will be loyal and loving. Number 18. Cyber Poo The Cyber Poo, or Husky Doodle, is a mix between Siberian Husky and Poodle. The Cyber Poo is a sweet and friendly breed that needs attention, otherwise they may act up. This breed fits best in homes with couples or families with older kids. They're quite active and will need owners who can be active enough to keep up with them. The Cyber Poo is a very loving and loyal dog that can be well behaved around children as long as they are properly socialized. The same goes for other pets and dogs. They're a good choice for owners who are inexperienced with owning dogs, although there might be some difficulty training them. They are, overall, cheerful and expressive pets. So what do you think? Which one of these 18 Poodle mixed breeds is your favorite? Let us know in the comments and share your experiences with other interested dog lovers. If you want to see more Poodle crossbreeds, you should also check out part 1, which you can see on the screen right now, or click the link in the description. If you loved this video, it would be great if you subscribe to our channel, so you don't miss new videos and learn more about dogs every day. And if you're looking for a new puppy for your family, Puppy Spot is the best place. They only qualify the highest quality breeders in the country and have already placed over 150,000 healthy puppies in loving homes. Click on the links in the description to find out more about Puppy Spot.